have decided to officially call it spring. It was a beautiful day today. Kids rode their bikes and played and I got some dirt spread. I did a little work in the pottery studio and <sighs> y'all don't bust my bubble and tell me we have one more big freeze because I know we might, but I'm officially calling it spring. I can't wait any longer. I'm going to start transplanting tomorrow, um, but not directly into beds yet because we don't have any beds built yet. So um, we will take the torch over where the peas are going and dig it out first. I would love to accomplish that this weekend, but sometimes my ideas are bigger than my time. So we'll see. <laughs> I do, however, have some nice little babies to show you over in the greenhouse. All right, so the onions, kales, radishes and beets. These I am planning on trying to put in tomorrow. Um, this year, the radishes and beets are gonna go into the tins. Um, the kales are gonna go in this tower right here. And this one, we have some arugula that I seeded straight in last week. And I believe up here we have a few of our spinach that are getting ready to start sprouting. So those are going to be the towers for the leafy greens. Um, and then in the covered greenhouse we've got our broccolis. <laughs> the Romanesco back there it says weird broccoli because I have a 14 year old boy and he's funny. <laughs> um, rainbow chard is coming up. This is the second succession of broccoli just starting to break ground. Over here, I don't have any petunias or marigolds to speak of as of yet or snapdragons there in the middle. Um, but we do have some red romaine, no celery still. And back there this morning, I saw just a few little lettuces popping up. There we go. Um, and we still only have one little impatient. Um, I did have, it's probably too dark to see right there, one little red basil popping up. So I have hope that in the next few days, we'll see some more through there. some dirt. Um, we've got a few wheelbarrow fulls <laughs> dumped out. Um, Save the spreading for you. Uh, and I did bring out these which is four peonies and 15 dahlias. When you're the kind of person who likes to grow flowers and uh, grow things, people like to give you things to grow. So those are going to be the first things in this bed. They were a birthday gift for me a few months ago. And I'm excited to get started, so let's do this. 